Let's have a little church. Yeah, come on, let's have a little church. Look over and say, Well, let the blood on this singing king. Come on, let's have a little church. Okay. 
not because we've been good, but because you've been good to us. And Father God, we ask, I ask now in the name of Jesus that you would hide me behind the cross and more of you would be seen and less of me. I ask in the name of Jesus that you would open the hearts and minds of your people up, help us to receive your word. Father God, not my will, but let thine holy will be done. All these blessed requests we ask in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. Certainly giving thanks to God for our being here, thanks to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and thanks to the precious Holy Ghost, our comforter and our guide. It is indeed a blessing from the Lord for us to be here one more day on this side of the river. One more day. Father God, we certainly thank you. My brothers and sisters in Christ, I will be scripture reading will be coming from Ephesians, the second chapter going down to the seventh verse. That again, that's Ephesians, the second chapter, uh, going down to the seventh verse. That is Ephesians, the second chapter, going down to uh, the seventh verse. And I will be reading from the King James Version. That in the ages to come, he might show the exceeding riches of his grace in his kindness toward us through Christ Jesus. For by grace are ye saved through faith, and that not of yourself, it is the gift of God, not a work, lest any man should boast. God's word for the saints of God, and God's word is already blessed. If it's the Lord's will, we would like to talk briefly from the subject, Rock of Ages rock of ages. The term rock mean different things to different people. But what does it mean to believers? What do believers think of when we hear the term rock? My brothers and Sisters in Christ, I am reminded of a story I heard read. A man who had been battered by a string of unfortunate events decided to walk and pray. He walked along the shoreline of a large lake. He noticed a small break between the rocks and observed that a tainted plant had taken root there. The plant appeared to be absorbing the right amount of sunlight and water, and it was also getting some things, something else, protection. No downpour or windstorm would ruffle its tender leaves. When the man saw the little plant snuggled safely between the powerful boulders. It reminded him of the old hymn, Rock of Ages. Clip for me. Let me hide myself in thee. In his distress, my brothers and sisters in Christ, the man found inspiration that he was surrounded by the power of our God who is the rock of ages. These are the words we think about when we consider or encounter other people with evil intention. People's characterized by pride, cruelty, and lack of regard for God. When, when, when we are the target of someone's wrongdoing, when we're the target of someone wrongdoing, we can remember the testimony of the psalmist in Psalm 94 and 22. But the Lord is my defense, and my God is the rock of my refuge. Ephesians 2 and 7 say that in uh, the ages to come, he might show the exceeding riches of his grace in his kindness toward us through Christ. The phrase, 
in ages to come refers specifically uh, to the coming generation. The same grace that was shown in biblical time would be shown to all generations. Christ, my brothers and sisters in Christ, Christ is able to sustain and support every person, whether it be a little child or a mature man of business. Christ may be trusted in every situation, in every circumstance, and at any time of the day or night. Uh, the rock in our lives, uh, uh, the fact that Jesus is a rock for all ages is important. He is also a rock for all circumstances. Uh, he's a rock for the young. Matthew uh, 19 and 14, he says, suffer little children and forbid them not to come unto me, for such is the kingdom of heaven. Jesus rebuked those who stopped and disregarded the children. He said that such action was wrong. We're not to stop little children from coming to him. Uh, we are to bring them to him. Uh, Jesus called for and received the children. Children were welcome. Even if they were so little, they had to be brought. Children may be too little to understand, but Christ is big enough to bless them and to see that the blessing sticks all through eternity. He is, after all, God. And as God, he is omnipotent, all-powerful, and able to exercise his power as he will. Children will in no way be rejected by him. Jesus said the kingdom of heaven belonged to children. He is saying two things. First, he's saying that uh, uh, he referred to here that children are a citizens of the kingdom, all right? Uh, at least until their mind mature enough to personally choose or reject him. Uh, such a time which you refer to as the age of accountability, please what? Children, such of all, demonstrate the traits needed to enter the kingdom of heaven. Children my brothers and sisters in Christ, children, uh, the child trusts Christ. The child responds to the call of Christ. The child uh, surrenders himself to Christ. He is willing to give up what he is doing to go to Christ. The child uh, was obedient to Christ. He obeyed and did exactly what Christ uh, request. Uh, the child was also humble before Christ. Now, 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 Christ is speaking to the disciples. Unless they are converted and become as little children, they shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven. If the disciples, my brothers and sisters Christ, if the disciples were one, about this, how much more are we and everyone else more? The absolute necessity of conversion is in our strength. And say, Verily, I say unto you, except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven. Uh, first of all, uh, as we look at this, he's a rock for the young. Then he is a rock in every situation. When we are in need of him, he's a rock. He said, I will lift up mine eyes. But David said, unto the hills from which cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, 
which made heaven and earth. He will not suffer thy foot to be moved. He that keepeth thee will not slumber. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is thy keeper. That's what it says. The Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. The sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve thee from all evil. He shall preserve thy soul. The Lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in from this time forward and even forevermore. When we are lonely, Joshua 1 and 9 said, Have I not commanded thee, be strong and of good courage. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee, whithersoever thou goest. When, when, when you're in the valley, uh -huh, he's a rock for that situation. David said, he go, mm, I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. Uh -huh, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thou rod and thou stand, and they comfort me. When, 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 uh, when you're sick, mm, uh, you need to remember that he's a rock in that situation. I just said he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And with his stripes, uh, we are healed. Yes, sir. When we're crying and when we are weeping. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, he heals. Ah, uh, 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 a rock for that situation. And David said, weeping uh, may do for nine, but joy comes in the moment. Yes, sir. In our journey, praise God, God has been a rock in a weary lane. Yes, sir. In our journey, God has been our shelter in a time of storm. In our journey, God has been our way out of no way. Yes, sir. In our journey, God has been hovering over trouble water. No wonder the songwriter says, Jesus is a rock in a weary land. A weary land. A weary land. A shelter in a time of storm. God uh, is uh, also uh, a strong presence uh, in our trouble. Yes, sir. Uh, Psalm uh, uh, 46 and 1 says, uh, God uh, is our refuge uh, uh, and strength. Uh, a very present help uh, uh, in trouble. Uh, ain't God all right? Uh, John. Uh, a ten and ten sail, uh, the sea coming, uh, not uh, but to steal, uh, but the sea comes not, uh, but to steal and to kill and to destroy. Uh, but I am come uh, that they may have life uh, and they may have a uh, more abundantly. Uh, I just said uh, in 54 and 17, uh, uh, no weapon. Uh, that is formed uh, against thee uh, uh, shall prosper uh, uh, in God uh, uh, alright uh, uh, as I uh, uh, get ready to leave you here uh, I want you to know that uh, we should remember uh, that we have uh, survived uh, uh, everything uh, life uh, have thrown at us uh, because all uh, we've been standing uh, on a rock. Uh, ain't God all right? 
but believe us, us down the rock, we supersede the more capabilities, the capacities of human behold we survived and sustained by the power of God when we left home and stepped into the unknown we cried Father I stretch my hands to thee there's no other help I know when we held our hands we understood when God held our hands we understood that he's a rock for all generations when we left home every night then we were saying precious Lord take my hand and leave me all we understood that he's a rock of all ages and my God alright I want you to know good God almighty who heals this rock ain't God alright he's the one who bones down in Bethlehem the one who carries cross for me and you who carries heal the one who carried his cross but they compel a man by the name of Silas to help him ain't God alright the one who let him dry nails in his hands the one who died oh God to heal the one who rose after three days and nights, oh Christ, the solid rock I stand, all of the ground is seeking sand. I want you to know why, as I get ready to close, when man was hungry, the rock became bread of life. When man was out the Lord uh, of the sea of light, uh, the rock uh, became uh, the bright uh, and morning star. Uh, hey, uh, God, all right, uh, when man uh, was sick, uh, the rock uh, became the great physician uh, of that he uh, uh, made healing. Uh, when man uh, was alone the rock became uh, a friend uh, that was sick closer uh, uh, than a brother. Uh, ain't a uh, uh, God all right. Uh, uh, I want you to know uh, this rock name uh, is Jesus. A uh, bear uh, baby. Uh, ain't God all right. A uh, uh, sin high uh, at the right hand of the Father. I'm uh, looking low. A uh, uh, pleading uh, for you and me. Uh, ain't God all right.
Blotter. 